But let's move on to the body, okay? Um, biggest thing that carries over from your mind to all your results with your body is discipline. Discipline is in here and it translates to everything you do. Any habit, anything important you have to do, which in this case, it's working out. That's the biggest thing that discipline has allowed me to you know, do so effectively is I work out six to seven days a week I started in January, gym and yoga January. I'm still doing workouts six plus days a week, still doing yoga two to three times a week. Uh, I just started mindfulness, um, no, meal prep and meditation March. So these challenges I've been doing for the past few years have brought me that discipline. Turning ideas into habits and then the discipline, I always say the same thing, guys. I've said it on my Instagram story. I'll say this to anybody that I wanna help is discipline is so important because even though I want to work out some days, some days I'm pumped. I got energy. I'm looking forward to my workouts. That's all fine and dandy. But it's those days that you don't want to work out. Everything in your mind is like, nah, do it tomorrow. You're fine. This is where the discipline is needed. This is why you have discipline because on the days you don't want to do something, in this case, work out, those days you don't want to, are the days you need to. If you're injured or sore or too sore, that's understandable. But if it's just your mind telling you, making excuses, oh, we'll do another day, this is where discipline, this is where all your training on discipline is needed. So you have that one part of your mind that's like, let's work out. But the other part is growing, the part that's like, no, I don't need to today. This small part will win because you're disciplined. That's what training my mind has allowed me to do with my body is stay disciplined, okay? Some parts of, of that I'm also doing, some parts of this discipline, my routines, okay? I wake up early, I make my bed, do my push-ups, pull-ups, ab workouts, meditate. I really, I really, this is like, I feel like I'm in the army. Like that's what I feel like. I, so I feel like I'm training. That's why I'm talking about being a warrior. I feel like I was made for this. I feel like I'm thriving by being tough on myself, doing the exact same things I need to do. And, you know, working out in the morning is a huge thing as well, okay? I can't stress movement is so important. I have a chapter in my upcoming book, uh, How to Vibe Out, an ebook about movement. Movement is medicine, okay? We all chase the dopamine highs when we want to feel good. We eat good food. We watch good shows. We laugh. We do drug substances, you know, liquor, alcohol, same thing, uh, cannabis, all that stuff increases our dopamine, right? We feel good. Endorphins are similar in that we feel good, but this is like the runner's high. Endorphins come from working out. So if I work out in the morning, I've set my day, that runner's high is gonna last me all day. So I'm chasing endorphins now. I'm not chasing dopamine as much, right? Um, endorphins are, are better for you. In my opinion, they do more for you. Uh, science shows they promote productivity, goal setting and concentration. My life is, is an example to that. I can attest to that. So yeah, I work out in the morning. I work out once, twice a day. 